Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Richard and thank you so much for landing on my page and taking the time to check out my channel and watch this video. I know there's lots of choice on YouTube at the moment um, and I know there's other places you can get your style advice so thank you for landing on my page. If you do like what you see, please consider supporting my channel by leaving a comment in the comment section below, smashing that subscribe button and also hitting that notification bell to the bottom right hand side of this video so that you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. Again, I'm also present on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook and Tumblr, so check out my pages on there and consider following me as well for more style advice and tips. I upload twice weekly on YouTube and twice weekly on my website blog, richardleestyle.co.uk, which is going to be up and running very shortly. And also, I upload twice daily on Instagram. Check me out there, guys. The video that I'm doing today is all about a review. It's the second uh, leather jacket review that I've done this week and this one is on the jacket that I'm wearing which is the Anti-Brown Soul Revolver The Deal Leather Jacket. I'll give you my thoughts on that and a full review after the intro. Hi guys, welcome back. Before the uh, intro, I told you that I was gonna be doing a review on uh, the jacket that I'm wearing today, which is the Antique Brown Soul Revolver, the Deal Leather Jacket. Um, I'll tell you what I think about that shortly, um, but also I just wanna make sure that you guys like what I'm doing in relation to the leather jacket reviews, and if you do, I'd really appreciate it if you leave a comment below. This is the second leather jacket review I've done for my personal collection uh, in the last seven days. I hope you like it. Um, like I said, this channel is all about style, uh, lifestyle and also reviews and I'll be doing them from time to time um, from pieces you may have seen already and from some new pieces that I might be lucky enough to pick up but essentially this is one of my favorite leather jacket brands Soul Revolver uh, based in the UK uh, all their designs are designed in the UK and made in Italy and there's about a two week uh, shipping time for these but they are made to your um, body um, measurements which is um, which is great. As I said to you before, customer service is second to none and it really is a big deal in leather jacket companies nowadays. Uh, I mentioned last week uh, Boda Skins, again a fantastic company based in the UK and their customer service is second to none, almost just like Soul Revolver. So on with my Soul Revolver, the deal leather jacket review, as you can see it's a very 1970s inspired leather jacket. You've got the big collar without going too big. Um, obviously you don't want to feel too conspicuous walking down the street with massive collars like wings. Um, they are flared slightly, uh, but nothing too big. So it is um, a 70s style jacket, but without the massive lapels. Uh, essentially, as you can see, it's a very, very slim fit, like all the jackets that I talk about on my channel. Slim fit is, is the way to go, guys, seriously, because leather will slightly give um, as it ages and as you age and it will conform to the uh, measurements of your body so you don't want to get a loose one you want to start off uh, as slim fitting as you can not tight but um, so it hugs your body essentially as you can see this one hugs uh, in all the areas it should do it hugs in my chest area here and in my torso also in my shoulders and the sleeve length um, perfectly um, where it should be just at the top of the wrist bone um, and obviously my watch is uh, is preventing it from going down a bit further but Believe you me, guys, it comes down to the bottom of my watch, which is perfect. You can see it on this wrist here. Um, I've got nothing on that wrist, so therefore it's hitting me exactly where it should on the wrist bone there. Uh, it's a waist length leather jacket. If I just move um, out of the camera shot a little bit so you can see, it hits just below the belt line. And as you can see, one of the best details about this jacket is slightly like a bomber jacket style. It has a ribbed waistband in a dark chocolate brown going all the way along the sides. And also, I'll bring the camera a bit closer, it's got a really nice thick ribbed uh, cotton cuff as well. Um, so essentially, it's a bomber jacket with a collar, if you will, um, for want of um, explaining it easier. Um, so it's a really slim, snug fit with really nice um, details to it. The brown uh, chocolate leather uh, ribbing is really nice. It feels quality, it feels solid. It's not like some of the cheaper brands that you can get where after a couple of wears, they become very loose very flabby looking. Think of a jumper that you've bought um, that gets very loose around the wrist um, and it, it basically just cheapens the look of it and it never regains its shape again. These are very thick quality pieces of um, cotton ribbing um, and they feel that they're meant, uh, they feel like they're gonna last a long time basically. The leather's sort of a mid-weight leather. It's got a bit, if I move close to the camera, it's got a bit of a shiny hue to it, but nothing too much that stands out. It's a really nice quality leather. As you can see, it's got some really interesting stitching. You could say almost a Western style stitching design pattern there, um, but it doesn't look um, 
quite so um, obvious on, it's just in the light, but it's a really nice 1970s inspired uh, leather jacket. Um, as I said before, I was born in the mid 70s. I'm a big fan of 70s style and 70s fashion. However, obviously I'm away, you can't walk around with big flares on now, but any little nod to, uh, to the 70s in a piece of clothing, uh, I'm a sucker for, unfortunately. And that's what prompted me to get this jacket a while ago, is the fact it was very 70s inspired. I know that Soul Revolver are a great company, so I knew I was gonna be in safe hands there. If you're a little bit concerned, like you might well be when you're laying out some money on a leather jacket online and you haven't got the option to go and try it on, as I've said to you many times before, you need to go to a company that have a fantastic customer service that don't just send you one off the rack, they make sure it fits you exactly right. Um, customer service um, representative Cian at Soul Revolver will contact you as soon as you make a purchase um, to make sure that you've got the right measurements. And as I've said, I think on my Capri Racer jacket video, uh, which I'll link to in the description below, um, you need to take measurements from your chest relaxed, uh, shirtless, uh, and also your waist around the belly button, which is the correct place to measure your waist. And then she will advise you on what size jacket to get. Now I'm an extra large, I've said this before, but just in case you haven't seen me before and this is your first video, I'm a 44 inch chest uh, and therefore that translates into an extra large size with Soul Revolver and it fits me perfectly as you can see. It is a slim fit so it hugs me nicely there and as I said, I'll just show you a side profile again, it's a really nice slim fit. Um, it hugs the torso, it hugs the bicep but doesn't constrict it. So as you can see, there's not a lot of uh, material there loose which I love it just fits really really nice there is just enough room that if you wanted to wear a thin gauge sweater underneath it or a thin hoodie you can do uh, if you felt that the collars were a bit too much and you wanted to cover it over a little bit and wear it pretty much like a bomber jacket you can do that you can wear it with a hoodie personally I love this style this is a really nice style for me uh, and I hope you'll agree it does suit me I wouldn't wear it normally with the navy trousers that I've got on now. Um, this was just a quick video to show you. I'd normally wear it with a pair of dot wash denim or um, even black jeans um, with brown boots. It's a really nice look. Keep it simple, guys, styling-wise, with uh, either an Oxford shirt or, as I've got here, um, a plain T-shirt underneath it. Um, this is obviously what it looks like undone. It's a very nice-looking uh, relaxed jacket. I'll just show you what the detailing is inside. Um, you've got a chocolate brown uh, nylon um, interior and you've got two zip pockets one on either side got one there no sorry um i stand corrected the one on the right hand side is an open pocket and the one on the left hand side is zippered uh, and that is pretty much it for the design guys it literally is uh, does what it says on the tin leather jacket it's a stylish jacket that's going to elevate your style uh, when you're out and about um i think the uh, slogan on the deal leather jacket on the soul revolver site is who wears the deal is he a good guy or a bad guy? You'll be too blinded by a style to notice. I think that's the tagline for the deal leather jacket and I think you'll agree, it really is a standout piece. When you don't always want a biker jacket or a cafe racer style leather jacket and you just want something a little bit different, um, this is the jacket to go for, guys. I'm a big fan of brown leather anyway. I've got quite a few brown leather pieces. This one is different to all of my other jackets. So now and again, it's nice to just look a little different, have a different vibe to your outfit. Uh, this one is like a bomber jacket with a collar, which I really love because everyone knows I'm a big fan of the bomber jacket in any case. Um, so yeah, this was just a quick review because there's not a lot I can say about it. It's a bomber length, um, bomber style jacket with a collar. Very 1970s inspired. Um, hopefully the lighting is good enough that you can see all the detail. You can see the yoke there on the back. And again, you can see how... Um, how it fits on the back is not tight it's nice there's fluid movement and it's got the nice stitch in here down the side oh uh, just before i forget guys actually it's got um nice little open hand pockets there um down at the bottom so you've got your two open pockets there you've got your two interior pockets and that is pretty much it guys for pockets it's a really simple slim fitting nice quality mid-weight brown or antique brown leather jacket from the uh, UK based company Soul Revolver. I'm gonna put a link to them in the description as well, soulrevolver.com. I hope you like my um, leather jacket review videos. If there's anything you think that I've missed, then please, please put a comment below. I'll get back to you straight away. 
I aim to, and I think other viewers will um, attest to this, I aim to reply to you as soon as I see it flash up on my phone, on my computer. I don't like to leave you guys hanging around. But after 48 hours, I would have moved on to my next video post. Um, so I hope you appreciate. If you've um, watched this video two or three days after I posted it, I may not get back to you as quickly as I'd like. But rest assured, I'll do my best to get back to you. I hope you like this video series. I'll see you on Thursday with another upload. Have an absolutely brilliant week and I will see you then. Take care guys.